I'm in the clearance. This is the clearance section. I think this is a brand new, this is actually a brand new um, situation they just added over here. It's a beautiful situation because this is their clearance shelf. Look at all the stuff on clearance, people. Can you see this? Are you, are you serious? Let's go over here. We're going to look at some of this stuff that I like. Um, do you see this right here? 397. This is called a backing pad for your grinder. Uh, it's a high quality backing pad. It's a pad that uh, outlasts and outbeats um, other brands that cost three times more. So that's something that I actually use right there. And it's on clearance for, you got it, 397. Um, does anybody use Rolo Lock discs? Rolo Locks. What a Rolo Lock disc is, it's a three inch disc that you use a special pad for, and then it, I'm a special pad, and then it locks on. I got them on clearance for 497 for one, two, three, four, five. You can't beat that price at all. I'm not going to get any today, but. Uh, it's a good price to have. So this is our clearance shelf, and they got a lot of stuff on clearance. I gotta say, clearance is looking good today over at Harbor Freight. Wow. I'm gonna go ahead and get this right here. I think I'm gonna go ahead and buy this. Um, it is on sale for $8.97. So I'm gonna go ahead and get that. Now, what you use this for, this is used for um, polishing. This is a miniature polisher that you would use with possibly your air drill. And what you do is you would polish your stainless steel and look what I just found. Here's our Rolo Lock pad. This is your three inch Rolo Lock pad. Huh. For 247, I'm gonna go ahead and buy one of those because that will actually hold not just this brand, but it'll also work with 3M Rolo Locks as well. So I'm gonna do a video on this action right here. I'm gonna go ahead and get that. And uh, we'll just leave these over to the side right here because I don't have a basket with me right now. And then I'll come back and pick those up. Is anybody looking for some uh, magnetic nut setter um nut drivers look at that 647 that's the hercules brand and 597 for the bauer brand something i do want to say that they have discontinued that i made a video about is this item right here this is now a discontinued item they are not going to sell it anymore i don't know why but uh i actually made a video about that and it turned out to be a good item and they got it on sale now for $94. Wow. So, I mean, you know, you come over here, you can find a lot of good stuff here. Here is a battery load tester, 500 amp for 50 bucks. Now that's just a tester, not a charger, people. A lot of good stuff going on here in Harbor Freight today. Uh, let's go ahead and walk the aisles just for a few minutes. Um, I came over here randomly just to see what they had. And anybody that wants to get a really good wax job, I'm gonna give you a tech tip right here. If you're waxing your car and you want the best possible detail job you can get, this number 21, that's one of the waxes that I use as a final wax after I color sand and buff a car, this synthetic sealant. Um, you ought to try that out because that stuff there, that's something I very recommend very highly if you are looking for a high quality finish. This is McGuire's. I can't, I've never actually seen them sell it like this um, because you used to be able to only buy that um, behind the counter. Um, they didn't sell it to the open public. So yeah, this stuff here, this is good stuff, people. Get it, $17. Ah. It's not a bad price at all. We're still on the clearance aisle, wow. Does anybody need a cutting torch? Here's one right here for $62. Huh. Damn. 
So Harbor Freight is really kicking it in. Um, this store here, I'm gonna tell you about this store here. They are very well stocked. This is in a very, very small town in uh, Utah. And I mean, you know, not all Harbor Freight stores are stocked like this. Not all of them are stocked. We're over here in the welding area now. And if you're a welder and you make stuff, get a set of these. This is nice to have. These hold your corners together and hold the metal together when you're just a one-man operation like my friend Pete. Um, I actually bought some of these and I was gonna make a video about them and I just haven't got around to it. I've seen a lot of people use these and I got a set of them. And look at the price of those, $7. Anybody that has used these, hey, get, get it, leave a comment and let me know what you think about that item. Um, it's actually made for when you butt weld two pieces of metal together and it holds the metal so you have a nice clean butt weld. So, yeah. Um, C-clamp. How many C-clamps does my friend Pete own? We don't need one today, thank you very much. Here's a nice action right here. This is a two-piece set for $13, look at that. A two-piece set and Look what you get in that for 13 bucks. Look at that. Two piece welding sheet metal clamp set. And then you get two, you got the, you got this one here and that one for 12, $13. Um, someone just left a comment and said that they use these, but they bend easy. So I really need to get those out so I can make a video about those. Um, and then of course they got the heavy duty magnets. Look at this right here, 90 pound. It's got a special button that you push on it. Wow, I've never seen one of those before. Now, how many guys out there are using gloves like this to weld with? Or do you just use regular gloves? Um, I tried to use a set of gloves like this before. I, I can't use them. I mean, I can't hold anything. I can't uh, precisely weld. I mean, these type of gloves are just I don't know, old school, old fashioned, you might say. Um, so let's go down here and just randomly walk around and see what we got at Harbor Freight today. Look at this. I've never seen anything like this. Look at these knee. It's like a robotic knee pad set. Uh, let's take a look at those right here. Wow, look at that. Is that a knee pad or what? And it's a gel fit fan fan fanatic. Huh. Well, for um, 50 bucks. And anybody that knows my friend Pete and been watching me long enough, I got bad knees. Bad knees are part of the job. Bad knees are part of the job. I like this. I might get me a set of those. I need those for a trailer. But what I'm trying to show you here, people, is Harbor Freight has pretty much everything you need. Has their gloves, look at this. Look what we got, guys. The gloves have went down half price. Gloves have went down half price from what they used to be. I can't believe it. Wow. Um, when the big pandemic was going on, they were like $20, $30 box but the price is coming down and Harbor Freight came through because they used to have a sign right here that said, um, when our price goes down and uh, we can lower the price, we'll pass the savings on to you. So I guess they're right. The price is coming down and yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and get me a box of these right here, um, XLs, because I need a box at my shop. So I'm gonna go ahead and pick one up now. Now, a lot of people have watched my video on the metal stripper machine, something that I do not recommend if you are looking to strip your car. Uh, if you haven't seen that video, watch it. Um, I don't even know where it was at. It was on one of these end caps, and I don't know where it is, so we're going to go ahead and pass on that. But um, once again, we're at Harbor Freight. We're walking the aisles. We're looking at stuff, seeing what the deals are. $2.99 for two flashlights. It could be a good deal for you. 
What is Harbor Freight doing for us today? <laughs> Let me tell you what Harbor Freight's doing for us today. Are you ready for this? Are you ready? They're putting Snap-on out of business. Harbor Freight is taking the handle and shifting it into fourth gear, you might say, and just making all the other tool places look like crap. That's what Harbor Freight's doing. Now, this is a good price for a spray mask. I don't know if it's a good mask. I would suggest this mask is probably a little bit better. Um, this one here is like a multi-change mask where you can literally change the filters out for $32. So you can use that mask for uh, grinding, sanding, or painting. I don't recommend that. I think you should have a separate mask for each individual item. Look at the price of this mask here. This is a sanding mask. And they want 30 bucks for that. That's pretty high price. I don't think uh, Harbor Freight's gonna be putting anybody out of business on those. Now, this is a good price right here. If you're looking for a paint mask, $17.99. Uh, the 3M masks are up to like 20 bucks now, $22. So that is a good price if you're looking for a mask. Um, I got a video coming out really soon about the PPE cup, uh, plastic cups. Make sure you watch that video. And I'm not going to tell you anything about it, but uh, waxes. What can we say, guys? We got it all here. This is it. This is it. Um, I'm debating on whether to buy one of these so I can do a video on it. And this is our, no, not this one. Where's the, the one I was looking at? Here we go, right here. I was randomly going, and leave a comment if anybody's used one of these. This is our orbital buffer. Now, this is a six inch buffer. This isn't a seven inch. So I was want, thinking I should buy one of these and do a hardcore video on it. But the problem that I have with using something like that is look at all the different steps that you got to take. All right, so they're making you buy, let's see, 10, 20, 30, that's $40 worth of pads that are throwaway pads. They're not, they don't last forever. So every time you use it, you got to buy a new pad, you got to buy this, you got to buy that. And it's a continuous type of tool that you always have to buy something to make it work. So we were talking about the Bauer buffer that they are discontinuing. And I believe this is why they're discontinuing it because the Hercules is $79.99. And they're getting rid of that. So they got the uh, Hercules buffer that's gonna take the place of the Bauer. That's basically what it is. Anyway, this was just a real quick walkthrough. Um, I got this one right here. Now, I did notice that the price went up. Price is up to $84. Uh, I think I gave 60 bucks for mine on sale. And I will say that this vise is very, very handy. It's a nice vise. I like the vise. It's a very good vise. And it works well for what I do. Um, they also have these big giant ones, of course, uh, which are a different brand. All right. And if you want to pay the extra money, of course, this is almost double the price. Look at here. This is $200. Very expensive. But if you're doing heavy duty work, you need a heavy duty vice. And I guarantee you, this is probably half the price of your outside other sources that's at home. Wow, look what we got here for all you woodworkers. That's new, I've never seen one of these here before. It is only $250, that's cheap. Jeez, it's a dust collector. That is crazy, crazy. Who said they wanted to uh, pour cement this weekend? Look what we got, 250 bucks for $99. That's not it, for $200, you can go with this one. Wow. I'm telling you, Harbor Freight is just a freight of stuff that is going your way. 
This is Pete, my friend Pete, your friend Pete. Um, sneaking in Harbor Freight, looking around randomly. I'm not even supposed to be in here with a camera, believe it or not. Did somebody say they needed files? Why would you want to go spend $50 for a file when you could buy a whole set of them for $7.99? I mean, how often do you use metal files? Come on, people. All right, times are tough. Times are hard. Times are like outrageous, okay? Save yourself a buck and get these ones. All right, do yourself a favor and, and wake up, okay? You know, we're living in the day of made in China, all right? You know, made in the USA, those days are over, people. The only thing that's done in the USA now is assembled, okay? You'll find a sticker on it that says assembled in the USA. Like that really matters, you know? That really, really makes a whole shitload of difference. Anyway, we're rambling here. Um, if you need a hinge, look here. Wow, look at that. They sell barn door hinges right here at Harbor Freight. They sell hasps and locks right here at Harbor Freight. Huh, who would have Who would have thought? This is Pete, my friend Pete, your friend Pete. Um, walking Harbor Freight and I was debating on getting this and doing a review on it. This is a plastic welding kit that you would use for plastic bumpers or possibly plastic fenders or other stuff that's made of plastic. But the reason I don't think I'm going to get that is because look what they got here, guys. It's being clearanced out. That means that it's being sold out and they're not going to sell it anymore. So I don't think I'm going to do a review on that. I think I'm going to go ahead and pass. Um, if I'm looking right here, look what we got. They got the Drillmaster 7-inch variable speed polish sander. Uh, that's the variable speed, and it's on sale for, we don't know, is that on sale for 30? Look at that. Wow. $34.97 for a 7-inch variable speed buffer. If you're looking to get a buffer, I say go down to Harbor Freight, your local Harbor Freight, and get one now because those aren't going to last long. That's, that right there is probably the best deal I've seen all day. Yeah, get one. And for 35 bucks, if it blows up after three or four uh, buff jobs or 10 buff jobs, who cares? Go buy another one for $35. Made in China, people. Made in China, right there. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and grab this and then I'm gonna scoot on out the door and hit the road. Okay, here, guys. Anybody that's into John Deere tractors, they got one specially for you right there. Oh. Let me get out of here, and maybe next time we'll look at something else. And they do sell WD-40 for all you guys that are into that lubrication, that need lubrication. There's a lot of people out there that need lubed up. Let me tell you, I run into them every fucking day. They got cans of them here, cans of them. And it's the specialist look. Specialist penetrating, fast acting, guys. It's fast acting and it's for penetration. Remember that right here at Harbor Freight. We gotta go. Take it easy.